mean to do this for a long time. So this right here is fish from Puerto Penasco that are caught off the surf. He used to have a really good knife. I recommend investing in an actual hunting knife. And to have um, the fish somewhat fresh. I don't like using rotting fish for this. I like using. Good fish. It's like anything, the quality of it's gonna depend on the quality of the inputs. So. This is this seems to be all fish. Nice. It's perfect. It is all fish. So we're gonna throw our catfish bait in there. Just shake it around. Okay, so I think that's pretty good. So I'm gonna get uh, okay, so let me back up here, y'all. Let me back up here for a little bit. So this right here is all kinds of fish guts from fish that I've caught fishing, aquaponic tilapia, and I put a 
lactose serum on it. So I'm going to let this start fermenting. And this is going to, I'm going to keep this stuff around for a long time. I'm going to add lactobacillus serum throughout the process. And um, the longest I, I, I let it go would be like a year in this bucket like this. But you could totally draw out and you should draw, draw out the liquid and use it and then replace serum in there as you as you draw it out to to keep it going to keep the fermentation going and um, most people only do this for a month but my experience has been that you don't really get the stuff to break down like you need it to so I like to do it for months up to a year so we're gonna put our lid on here <laughs> 